Tyler One, a League of Legends content creator, mostly known for his toxicity and his Twitch streams, like this clip coming up. Ah, I'm gonna win! I'm be masters! Has led people to believe that he and many others have created League of Legends into being a toxic place. Tyler One got popular off of his rage compilations, his good Draven gameplay, but mostly his screaming. A lot of the young fans liked his screaming and his rage compilations, and they really took it to a next level. It took more than head games to stop me. You may have invaded my mind and my body, but there's one thing to say and always keep his <laughs> As Tyler1 started to get more and more popular on Twitch and YouTube and other platforms, he started to make a reputation of himself for being super toxic, not caring about the community, and overall just not giving any thought into what he's doing. This led to Tyler getting over 22 perma permanently banned accounts. And this is kind of a big deal for League of Legends because he reached such a high level that they actually banned his IP so if they ever found out he was playing on any account, it would be permanently banned instantly. This started to become like a game for Tyler though, because in all in all, he was making a lot of money off of it. And so as the money started to pile up on him, he was making over 75000 a month before tax. Soon though, Riot caught up to his shenanigans, and he was indefinitely banned from League of Legends. I'm gonna miss you guys. I'm gonna miss you guys, I am. It's been fun. I've had a fun, uh, you know, a fun time streaming with you boys. I have. It's been fun. Girl score, I'm, I'm, I'm coming with you, man. Not banned on Twitch, no. I still have that. This story does have a happy ending, though. Although Tyler1 was banned from League of Legends, around two years later, he was unbanned. And this allowed Tyler1 to tra traverse his way back into the Twitch scene. As bad as some people think he is, he did create a new type of League of Legends. One where people can flame and not get as ridiculed for it. And this might not be such a bad thing, because sometimes people do deserve it. And even though he doesn't have the best reputation in the community, I think he has changed the community. Whether for better or not, that's up to you to decide. But nonetheless, he did change it, and he's here to stay.